I want to give um, Bill all the credit in the world. Uh, they were tough. They out rebounded us, which re rarely happens. Uh, they hustled. You know, they converted our turnovers. Uh, they beat us up on second chance points. And uh, we just didn't have our best game today. There were stretches where we played some decent basketball and we got the ball in the middle against their zone. And we got some guys some open threes and Riley Norris gave us a huge lift off the bench. But uh, we just didn't play enough of a 40 minute game to win a game on the road. So uh, this was the opposite of how we played our last game at home. But uh, give them credit, they had a lot to do with it. Questions? Avery, they've had a penchant for second chance points Baylor has throughout the year. Something you harping with your players is just their tenacity just was kind of a difference, or what did you see there? Yeah, even like Mark, you know, Lido, he, he got four offensive rebounds, and that was huge for him. That was a big point of emphasis. Uh, this was the best offensive rebound team we faced this year. Uh, and, but there have been some other teams that are bigger and stronger that are great offensive rebounding teams, and we kind of diffused those situations, but we just didn't do it tonight. Uh, big point of emphasis for us. Mm -hmm. the, the second chance points, hustle game, you know, they had one loose ball across from our bench, and they got to the loose ball before we did, and they got on the floor. <laughs> our last game at home, we had five guys on the floor. So we've been a little inconsistent. Um, you know, we were in the last road game at Tennessee, who's the number one team in the country, and came up showing it. Now we're right here in this game and turn the ball over, and we don't make the right plays at the right time. Avery, what do you think of the way Baylor's pulled it together since Tristan Clark went out? Yeah, they've done a nice job, and they've gone small, uh, and they're tough. You know, all those guys can handle the ball. Uh, you know, obviously, you know, without even looking at a stat sheet, you know, Mason Mason is a problem. You know, and he's experienced and he's crafty. Uh, reminds me of a little baby John Stockton in a lot of ways. I'm sure my age, but uh, and obviously we know Jared Butler, and he got him off to a good start with a couple threes. But uh, they, they pulled it together, and that's what you got to do because nobody really feels sorry for you. Any other questions for Coach? You enjoy the uh, the Big 12 SEC thing in the middle of conference play? Do you like having it there? Yeah, yes, I, I really don't complain. You know, I'm glad that we're a part of it. We were honored to represent our conference. We didn't do a good job. You know, last year we beat Oklahoma at home, and now we've come on the road, and we didn't do a great job of representing our conference like we wanted to. And, but I think that it's something that I wanted to be a part of. We weren't a part of it my first two years at Alabama, but it's something I lobbied for, and fortunately it worked out for us, and hopefully um, hopefully we can continue to be a part of it. I think it's great for basketball. I think it's really, especially with the way the SEC has come on for, for a basketball conference, not a football conference. When you place eight teams in the tournament, uh, we, we you never know, we might get nine in this year, the way things are, are going. So we're, we're honored to be a part of it. Uh, I think there are going to be some incredible games today. Coach, with you met, kind of mentioned it, but with, in a tight game like that, how big were those turnovers late when, when it's right there? In any of, sport, turnovers, yeah. they, they just, you know, they handcuff you uh, in any sport. So whether you call it across the street at your football stadium, an interception or a fumble, or at, you know, whether it's an error on a short stop in baseball or a turnover in basketball, they just, they just hurt you especially when you have the critical ones at the wrong time, or if you turn it over and they run out and score on you got your hand. Um, I used to like turnovers when I was in college. When I was, when I was about to turn the ball over, I threw it, kind of threw it in the stands a little bit. So they could score. score. Yeah. Yeah. All right, thank you guys, appreciate it. Thanks.